Hello everybody, this is Roxy and um, I have a Friday Dollar Tree haul. It's been a long time, I think two weeks, which is long. So I got, it's almost all new stuff, except for like maybe one, one thing that I have not seen there. Yeah, so everything I have, I have not seen, except for one or two things. Okay, this is some new, I love this design so much. I think I might actually keep this pouch this time, but it's a breakfast blend, and I use Starbucks um, breakfast blend, so I can guarantee you it won't compare, but we'll see how it is. I love the red. It's a really cool red color. So there's that. This was a three pack, but my friend and I, oh my gosh, she's the one that suggested, I'm like, mmm, honey mustard and onions on pretzels, I don't know. They are so good, I can't believe it. So, if you see them, they're really good, they're nice and crunchy, they're little bits and pieces, and they're awesome. Like the first, the second I put it in my mouth, I was like, oh, I don't know, this is good. It's really good. So if you like honey mustard and you like pretzels, give them a try. And then this, they got all kinds of this. Um, organic diced tomatoes from Hunt's and they're two for a dollar. They had some fire roasted, but to me that sounds spicy hot and I don't do that. And then they have sunny, I thought it was sunny sex. Sunny sea sardines I love sardines so I thought I would give them a try I mean they're a buck but you know how much are sardines so one is in tomato sauce one is in brine so I'll give those a try and I'll keep it posted and then I have not seen this they had a ton of different um, veggies and I gotta get these in my freezer for a dollar, they're, they're pick sweet. I mean, you know, that's a really good brand. We use that all the time. Especially for like hot dish and stuff. You know, can't beat it. And of course, my all time favorite artwork and candy bar is the marshmallow stover milk chocolate. So there's all that. But these are a steal. I would want to. I'd like to stock up because, you know, I go through this. But the steamables are nice because you can just um, um, throw them in the microwave or just in a little pan. And you got yourself a side. Oh, yeah, I got to put this in here. And I can't wait to try these sardines. So I'm just going to put this out of the way. And hunts are good, too. Um, I like to do, like, I can my own tomatoes, but I like to hoard, not hoard them. I like to make them last all year. So I use those for, like, spaghetti, um, kind of hot dish, because, you know, you really taste the flavor and um, stuff like that. So for chili... I'll use like a canned diced tomato because I like the we like the tomatoes diced more. Plus, it's chili, you know. I mean, got all kinds of flavors going on. I forgot about this too. I got one of these. I think I did get this before. I don't remember. I don't remember. They got hazelnut, and then they had a lemon kind too. So, gotta try the hazelnut. Oh, and food wise, look at how cute little kind of gummy bear stuff. Well, it's not gummy bears. But isn't that cute? So I'll see what it looks like. I probably just like the Welch's. We'll give it a go. Now I got Gitchy Gitchy Wawa. That Mar Lady Marmalade. Hey, Joe, you want to give it a go? Mm, they're good. Mm, a little chewy. Yeah. 
They're okay. Mm. They're kind of hard. You know, like hard to chew. Hard to wise. But they taste alright. They're a lot of work though. Alright, then we had some movies. Uh, my friend and I just watched a video top 10 romantic movies that nobody talks about. And this was what, number one. So I thought we'd do that. This one she said was really good. And I think I've seen her and stuff. So that looks cute. And then I love Bill Geist and Willie Geist and I'm surprised this book's already in there. So I thought I'd get that for the Scrubmeister. I love Bill Geist, he's really nice. And I love Diane Keaton. And this is about her mom. And um, I just thought that'd be interesting. She's kind of an interesting gal. And so I thought I'd give that a try and see what that's about. Miss Diane Keaton. And I need a new um, stylus for my Kindle. So I've used these before. In fact, the one I have, the you know how the rubber tip gets old? So I just needed a new one. So I thought I'd grab a couple while they, because they don't always have this. I like this smaller size because it fits right in my um, Kindle holder thing. All right, then I think I'll do this one next and leave my fun H and B for the uh oh. Oh wait, that's okay. I'll leave my fun H and B one for last. It's got a lot of cute stuff. Not a lot, but a few things. All right, now I needed this because Rose King and I are swapping. Um, decorative or decorated store-bought flowers and the way she did hers I had to copy it now um, she sprayed them with adhesive spray doused them with glitter and they turned out so pretty so because I've always just like you know painted on Mod Podge or whatever but so I thought I'd try this adhesive spray out I know I got a can down in my art layer but when I saw it I forgot that I have one so I went and bought it um, these are new colors that I've never seen in our store for the little notebooks that you can cover and sell because I got to gear up for a sale. Oh my god, it's coming up in April and I am ready, not ready at all. So, and then I almost passed this by like a dirty shirt, but I caught it at the last second. Little skinny washi tape, but nice stuff because the last stuff I bought it all and I don't like it. So I think I I think I already de-stashed it. But look at there's like diamond rings, musical notes, glitter. I am very busy. And then gold and yellow. Or yellow and gold. That one. And then this one. Be happy. And some more um, diamond shape. So there's like the yellow is repeated, the diamond shape re is repeated. I'm going to save this one for last. This one is awesome. Big dream. <laughs> that is so funny when things are lost in translation. Instead of dream big, it's big dream. That is hilarious. Do what you love. Awesome. So that's cool. Nice little glitter ones. And then this one was hiding and I thought, I know there's a fourth one. I know it because there was the last time. So this is it. Days. Oh cool, it's like a line. Days left. And then make it happen. Oh, polka dot gold. And then like a honeycomb. So those are cool. I didn't go through that. There's a postal stripe. The dot. 
I think I only did the... Yeah, so that's cool. I love the big dream. <laughs> funny, funny, funny. So that's the um, stationery aisle. I can't believe how much I spent. Oh my gosh. I knew it was going to be high, but I didn't think that high. All right, now I've seen these little bunny baskets, the cute canvas ones, and I finally found them. And I was going to get one for everybody at Easter because we're having Easter, but then I thought, well, old guys or guys aren't going to want one. They're going to go, what do I want that for? So I just got one for me, for Scrubby, and for my niece. Because she and I exchange a lot of Dollar Tree stuff. So these are adorable. These are new. I haven't seen them yet. They didn't have them last year or year before. I bought this because I think what I'm going to do is cut off this rope and then unravel it. So it looks like a couple of little carrots. Because I sure as heck ain't going to jump rope. I found a really pretty Easter card for scrubs. The Scrubmeister. Pretty. They really have pretty cards. Says a card maker who shouldn't be buying cards. And then that's for little Sheila. She always thinks every time I bring a bag and she gets pushing her face in because she thinks I got a toy. So I've conditioned her to find that that is true. And then this for St. Patrick's Day. We may or may not be marching in the parade this year. His, um Bill's cousins, they started marching in the parade. They His family used to. And then they quit doing it in about the late 70s, I think. And now his cousins started, I think, last year, the year before. So his one cousin's son, or second cousin, whatever they are, already sent us a save the date card. So I think, I don't know. See, I'd like to see all the goofballs driving or going by. Because if you're in the parade, you only see the goofball stand and watching you. So I'm not sure if I'm going or not. I kind of sitting on the fence. Okay, then I found this. They've got some really nice, they're little wood magnets. And they've got like, He is Risen and um, Christ Saves My Soul or Jesus Saves My Soul. But really nice little sayings. I thought that'd be nice for the fridge or whatever. And then here's those adorable... They are as cute in person as they are on your screen. Just totally cute. And my store, they had two stacks of them, which is, I mean, I, I always figure it's going to be gone when you get there, but, I mean, look at the little handle. How oh, cute. I'm going to kick myself for not getting a bunch for the rest of them. Er, and then look at the boy one. Isn't that cute? They're so cute. So I have, that's that, and that is, oh no, that isn't it. See, I almost forgot. I got it. Too ditzy some days. All right, so that's the Easter stuff. And these are just fun. I'll probably make, I don't know, something out of it or whatever. Okay. And then, these are so cute. Okay, so they had um, lemons, apples, and strawberries. Um, lip balm, so I got a strawberry one. Then I found this adorable little unicorn one. It's so cute. My friend's like, you're not really going to get that. I'm like, I uh, watch me. Look how cute it is. It's probably gross, but who cares? I can't even get my big hand in there. Oh, it tastes like strawberry. Yeah, that's not bad. It's, you know, like putting wax on your lips, but who cares? It's cute. Little unicorn. And this is weight, oh wait, never mind, not yet. This is cool, that'll be nice in my purse. Because I always have to put hand lotion and cream on. And Dove's good, I like all their products. 
All right, this is adorable. My friend thought it was an owl. So she put it up like that, and I'm like, what are you doing? And I said, it's a hedgehog. Isn't that cute? He's a unicorn hedgehog. How cute is that? They had silver and gold. They had a really cute elephant. And I think a bunny or something. A cute little piggy bag. That is adorable. And it's even got a little stopper. So that is it. Lots going on here. And like I said, I think it's the most I've spent in one stop. But you know what? If I'm not going to go, I'm trying not to go every week. Because it just gets too crazy. So, well, you know, basically what I'm doing is, instead of spending $20 a week, I spent 40 So there you go. Doesn't matter how many times. Anyways, that's it. And I will see you later. Thanks for watching. Bye. Take every chance you dare. I'll still be there